y'all. It's Angie and Chris from Canterbury Trails Farm, and we are finally sanding. Got most of the floors done. Chris is wrapping up back there. I'm going to run out to the garden. See the big pear tree is about done for the year. There's still some really giant pears up there, but I had to choose between work, work, like the sanding and everything today, or getting pears. And I need a little bit of a break from the pears. <laughs> I've been doing it all week and the week before, so I think I think we'll be okay. I'll get some more of those if they're still, usually they hang around till, until October usually till they're completely gone. Okay, so I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna show you my pumpkin. Pumpkins are doing really good. My wisteria is doing really good. Oh look, I got a pretty tea rose. It's very sweet smelling. So everything's doing really good out here. I have it mowed. My, my grandpa bush. And my grandma bush. And the, this wisteria is doing good over here. And Mr. Rocco Taco, our old, he died um, literally a month shy of his 19th birthday. Really, really, we're sort of um, traumatized by it. We, I mean, we knew it was coming. I mean, he was old. He was a very old cat. But he was a good boy, and we got this. It's granite, and it was really nice. We weren't expecting it to turn out as nice as it does is, and it has this picture on there. And his birthday, 2003 to 2022. His birthday was September 1st and he passed away on August 3rd so he almost made it so he's out here so I have my memorial roses and Dot this is Dottie's garden for where we found Dottie but it's really coming together the whole little garden um, you can see the it's just really pretty Pumpkins and squash are doing good. I hope I get some. But so I'm gonna go back in and we're gonna wrap up the sanding. That's just a little update on what's happening. Once we get the, the floor sanded, we can get the floor stained and the baseboards on, and then we can move in carpet, the the floor rugs, and we can move in some beds, and we can start having like civilized world not having to sleep on cots <laughs> it's been rough for the last few years we're really excited about this new phase and then we can we're painting the kitchen cabinets and we can get the laminate and the kitchen done and then next year we want to do the bathroom so that's the plan we're hoping by the end of the year have some significant move it, movement because we got to start on Anna's house so that's the plan this has been Angie from Canterbury Trails Farm and just a little update to let you know what's going on. See you later.